Will a winter storm gently coat the ground with light fluffy flakes? Or will it plaster everything in sight with heavy wet snow? The weight of snow is determined by how much liquid is packed into each flake. This process occurs in higher, colder parts of the atmosphere, where ice crystals grow, forming snowflakes. The amount of water vapor in the atmosphere, or water in its gas form, along with the temperature, control the total liquid each flake contains. Generally, the more water vapor that's available, the wetter and fatter the flakes become. Conditions with an abundance of water vapor produce the classic large, penny-sized snowflakes, whereas drier conditions produce smaller plates and column-shaped flakes. This entire process controls how much liquid water is contained in each inch of snow. Say one inch of liquid water fell as heavy, wet snow. This would produce around eight to 10 inches of accumulation but a dry snow could pile up to double or triple that accumulation from this same amount of liquid. Next time you're hoping for either fluffy powder for skiing or packing snow for a snowball fight, remember all the science that's going on up in the air. For Weather Nation, I'm meteorologist Carissa Kloss.